When one speaks of love, Lord, people often assume they are thinking of the same thing. But how many kinds of love there are? I remember that when I met you, I had no anxiety over my love for you. Perhaps because it was you who had met me and you wanted to fill my heart. I remember that sometimes I was all on fire, even while I felt the burden of my humanity as though I were carrying a great weight. But already by that time, your grace enabled me to understand a little of who I was and who you were, and I saw that new flame as your gift. And then you showed me where to find you, Under the cross, you told me, under every cross is where I am. Embrace it and you will find me. You told me many times, and I do not remember all the objections I offered, but you finally convinced me. And then, with each suffering, I thought of you, and my will responded with its yes. But the cross remained. My soul was bathed in darkness. I suffered torments of all kinds. How many crosses there are in life. But then you taught me to love you in my neighbor. And when suffering came, I did not stop there, but accepted it. And forgetful of myself, turn my thoughts to you standing at my side. After a few moments, I would regain my composure and find that my sorrow had vanished. So it was for years and years, the constant discipline of the cross, the asceticism of love. I underwent many trials and you know all about them because you have counted the hairs on my head and numbered each one. Now, love is a someone. It is not just an act of the will. I knew that God is love, but I did not believe it was anything like this.